UPS was just here. Here's the box. Let's see what happens when we open it. There is a salty fragrance to this container, even with the lid on. So what do we have here? What is this? I, you know, I'm not good at identifying fish. Looks terrific, hold on. Okay, now this is one nice, big, fat, whatever it is. Um, I, I guess there's a note on the box. Let me open the note. Okay, no note. <laughs> Tell me what it was. All right, I will text you. Here it is. I'll send the picture. And I, <clears throat> yeah, this is going to be a very special dinner. I'll do some scalloped potatoes and just the fish just as it is, maybe with a little lemon juice, nothing more. So here's our process. Um, I'm not gonna to try to, to fillet it because I really don't know how and I don't wanna mess it up. But head and tail are going to make stock and then this is going to go into the parchment. Okay, change of plan. I realized that to fillet it, it's pretty much the same as I used to do at the Bruner Brothers, filleting whitefish for it and break the collar once the collar's broken, the rest pretty much comes off. And it, it's choppy. I did chop it up a bit, but I got it. And at least I get more um, uh, fish from the, uh, the bones, from the ribs, for stock. So it's not perfect, but it's not horrible. So here we go. Salt, pepper, a little bit of onion, butter, olive oil, and that's it. Oh, yeah, the tomatoes. Now I'll wrap them up and put them in the oven for uh, eight minutes. So here we have it. I don't have to be jealous anymore. There's this beautiful fish. So simply done. I'm just going to add a little bit of lemon juice. Maybe, no, maybe not even. And the scalloped potatoes and my um, zucchini and tomatoes from the garden. Best dinner. As I said, I don't have to be jealous anymore. Gorgeous, gorgeous dinner. Thank you so, so much. Couldn't ask for anything better for the summer. Take care.